Howdy everyone. So I'm going to do a little quick video demonstrating how it's easy to spot regions of space that are occupied or different dimensions are overlapping. So you see it's kind of notice, not noticeable anything unusual until like we're looking around I kind of see grass, we see, you know, this space. Now, when we get over here, we just kind of notice an area of space where only trees occupy. This is how you recognize habitation circles when they possess trees. Now, we're going to go over here to the cemetery. So we see like kind of this normalness of wilderness. There's no real protruding obviousness. I mean, there's a space in the tree right here, but that one's not very big. It's not defined like this one is over here. But this space actually has to do with the graveyard. So we get to the graveyard and it's clear when you look at the graveyard, there's a clear sense of boundary and barrier. Like that little protruding area extends from the graveyard. Like you can, like you notice the difference in landscape, just obviously. Like right, right here, there's a difference. And over here, and you can see, I don't want to go in the graveyard yet until I, do the proper incantations, but like when we go over here, more of the graveyard. Clear boundary space area that is clearly different than the surrounding landscape. We see, we see the literal boundary between the graveyard, Helenheim, and the normal world, Midgard. Yes, the dimensions overlap because our matrix is a system comprised of different laws of physics and energies interacting and working in collaboration to create our 3D realm, Midgard. Midgard is also a term that is similar in connotation to the phrase nowness.